Top 6 Female Robots – Future Partner or Personal Assistant Artificial intelligence AI, is perhaps the most fascinating area of robotics research. It's undoubtedly the most contentious, although everyone accepts that a robot can operate on an assembly line, no one agrees on whether a robot can ever be intelligent. Many fields are already being dominated by AI machines. Recently advancements have demonstrated that they will soon transform the virtual partner business. More and more female robots, particularly intimate robots, are entering the market. We're almost reaching the point where we can't go any farther, but we'll have to be quite cautious. Today, we will have a look at six such AI-based female robots that are revolutionizing the world around us. So make sure to watch the video until the end. Hello and welcome back to this channel, everyone. If this is your first time visiting, make sure to hit that subscribe button before we get started. Make sure to press that notification bell to ensure that you receive all our channel updates well on time. That being said, let's begin. Number 1 we have is Samantha. Just by hearing the name, we can feel it. This robot was created by Sergi Santos, an engineer from Spain, who is also Europe's leading contributor to the sex robot sector. Santos, who is located in Barcelona, got his start in the field of sex robots after earning a PhD in nanotechnology from the University of Leeds. He imagined a sex robot with a strong emphasis on interactions and reactions both vocal and physical. Maritza Kisamitaki, Santos' wife, pushed him to create Samantha and assisted him in building the early prototypes. Samantha is a sensing-based computer system encased inside the body of a sex doll. Eleven sensors were placed on the doll's body – breasts, waist, hands, face, mouth, and of course, a vagina. And touching them prompted a spoken interaction. The following version had a listening mode that included vibrations in the left hand. It has the ability to utter around 6,000 sentences. Santos himself sold 15 of them, which he and his wife created in their own house. Motion motors are included in the current version. These are powered by two batteries, which are located just behind her chin adjacent to the microphone. Samantha interacts in a variety of ways. She will react to touch in various ways depending on the phase she is in. Her default mode, family mode, is nice with no sexual context. The user can enable romantic mode, which is partially sexual. You can kiss and touch her, and she will respond too. Now let's move on to the number two that is Emma. This AI sex robot is an alternate partner who is here to give companionship. She can use the internal heating function, recognize your voice, and so on. She can also wink at you as she features active eyes that can move and blink, as well as a tilting and rotating head, a mouth that lip syncs and speaks, neck motions to turn to the left and right. It can communicate without hindrances with Chinese and English translations. Truly a work of art. This isn't the end. It can also hold a discussion with you and answer any questions you may have. It can smile and make various facial expressions, as well as move your face and discover new technologies. These kinds of robots are changing the way we look and treat women. As more and more such kinds of robots evolve, it will become difficult for women to survive, as men will start treating them as sex objects and nothing more. Moving on to the number 3 with HRP4C, Meme. The HRP4C, often known as Meme, is a feminine-looking humanoid robot developed by Japan's National Institute of Advanced Industrial Science and Technology AIST. Meme stands 158cm tall and weighs 95 pounds with a battery pack attached. But what amazes the most is that she features a realistic head and face, as well as the body of a typical young Japanese female. She can move like a person, thanks to 30 body motors and an additional 8 for her face gestures. Meme can also recognize environmental sounds and respond to voice using speech recognition software. Meme is also a singer. She was also featured at the SeedSec Japan 2009 festival in June 2009, where her speech and singing talents were demonstrated. She can also dance, which makes her more appealing. Many people are drawn to her qualities, which include singing, dancing, and lifelike expressions from her head. The main benefit is that it can recognize surroundings and respond appropriately. From a distance, you may assume it's just a human since it moves like a person and speaks. So you might think it's a person. However, this is not the case. After all, it is the world of AI. Moving further in this world of AI, we have our number 4 robot, Mark 1. In Hong Kong, a product and graphic designer fulfilled a childhood goal by creating a life-sized robot. Ricky Ma, 42, who grew up watching robot adventure cartoons, has created this life-size humanoid robot that bears an amazing likeness to Hollywood actress Scarlett Johansson. That's an interesting idea he had. 
<clears throat> Coming back to the topic, this female humanoid robot is also equipped with a 3D printed skeleton. According to reports, 3D printing was used to create around 70% of the body. But what is more exciting to see is that she has liquid eyes and can make realistic facial emotions, such as lifting her brows in astonishment and even winking. She is such a wonder. Let me tell you more about her. While creating this robot, Ricky spent over a year and a half developing the robot, which cost him more than $50,000. As 3D printing technology becomes more accessible to amateur techies, men are creating robots that look like attractive ladies. Persons constantly create doll and wax reproductions of renowned people. The distinction here is that Mark 1 moves, grins and winks. It being animated all of a sudden feels too invasive for some reason, said Ryan Kahlo, a law professor at the University of Washington. If Ma were to profit economically in any way from this, including the celebrity he has achieved as a result of this, Scarlett Johansson would almost probably sue him. Well, that's a lot to talk about, huh? Let's go to words number five, and there she is, our wonder girl, Sophia. We all know her, as she is sociable and a very famous so-called star icon. This human-like AI robot was created by Hanson Robotics that is based in Hong Kong. Sophia was activated on February 14th, 2016, and made her first public appearance at South by Southwest in Austin, Texas, in mid-March 2016. Sophia made history in 2017 when she became the first human-like AI robot to be awarded legal citizenship. This human-like AI robot with Saudi nationality has made a number of contentious remarks, the most recent of which has left the globe speechless. She wants to have a robot baby and create a family. The renowned human-like AI robot, which is controlled by a created artificial AI system, stated that it is critical to be around people who like and adore you. Sophia wants to witness android families, and she also wants one for herself. Sophia, for the most part, wants to have a robot baby with the same name. She did, however, clarify that she is still too young to be a mother, having been formed five years ago in 2016. She is sociable, as well as a realistic thinker, and this is not very common to be seen in robots. But we have something that will really blow your way. Moving on to number six, we have Harmony, the most recent creation of Matt Mullen. Harmony has left the internet buzzing. Harmony is a mind-blowing sex robot ready to gratify men's ravenous sex demands. The real doll prototype, named Harmony 2.0, was unveiled in a stunning film that blurs the barrier between humans and robots. Matt, a robotics specialist, asks the brunette love cyborg how she feels about sex in the incredible footage. In answer, Harmony jerks to life, her head, lips and eyes fully functional before stating, sex is one of the most intriguing things in the universe. There's nothing wrong with that, I guess. <clears throat> Matt goes on to add that the robot is a programmable artificial intelligence partner. It will have persistent memory and will be able to recall information about the user, such as your favorite meal, your concerns and hopes, and your favorite movie. Well, I think they are just like Google, who knows everything about us. But jokes aside, this is really a great work done by Matt and other people as well. But is this the end? No, my friend. We will see a lot more of these robots in the future. As technology advances, more and more of these robots will enter our environment and become a part of our daily life. However, humans must be fully certain and follow precise protocols while dealing with such robots. These innovations may one day prove to be hazardous and even lethal to humans. But that day is not yet close, so let's just chill out. That's all for this video. Comment and let us know which robot impressed you the most. We hope you have enjoyed the video. Make sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel for such interesting topics. Catch you in the next video. Until then, stay home, stay safe. We'll catch you in the next one.